Howdy y'all, this is Shane and you were listening to the Spur Guitar Tech Boost Pedal with the In The Blues logo on there. This isn't actually my pedal, but it's a great example of what Spur Guitar Tech can actually do for you. He builds great custom pedals coming out of the UK. A big thanks to Spur Guitar Tech for allowing me to demo this, I really appreciate it. And putting the In The Blues logo on there is great. So this pedal could be used in a number of different ways. The first way is the conventional volume boost or preamp boost style, which is what I was just using it as straight into the amp or you can use it before your pedals to push all your other pedals, either with more gain before it or after, depending on how you like to run it. If you use this pedal at the end of your chain, it will actually act as a treble boost, which is pretty cool, as well as pushing the volume, but it will act more as a treble boost in that situation, which is really cool. Using it before a fuzz pedal will give you just epic fuzz sustain, so we're gonna try that as well. So the way I'm running it is basically into the amp, just pushing it as hard as it can go. And that was with the pedal on max in that clip. So let's give this a shot. I'm playing my Squire Classic 5 into my 65 Deluxe Reverb. And I'm gonna show you the difference without a backing track just to show you how the pedal sounds. So here we go. You might also notice that there's no marking. So I've got the pedal all the way to the left right now. So it's as low as it will go. at about halfway. At about three quarters of the way up. So you can hear it's starting to push the sound now and all the way up. Now we're going to see how it goes pushing an overdrive pedal. This is my clean tone. This is with the Overzoid overdrive pedal. And with the boost on about halfway. So let's go ahead and crank up the boost all the way.
So this is how it sounds in front of a fuzz pedal. This is the barefoot Arctic white fuzz. It's awesome and here we go. So as you can hear, it gives you epic sustain with a fuzz pedal. Working with it, it sounds fantastic. Thanks for watching. That was the Spur Guitar Tech Boost Pedal with the In The Blues logo. If you do like this pedal, check them out in the description below. They're very, very cool. And I love the fact he can actually print logos on his pedals for people. You might want your name on there. You might want you know, your brand or company on there as well. So he makes great handmade stuff in the UK. Not only does this pedal sound fantastic pushing other pedals, it also sounds great pushing a tube amp to the next level. So one of the big benefits of this is it's going to sound great with my 68 Deluxe Reverb when it's cranked. We found that using certain types of pedals with mid humps took away from the tone whereas this will keep your tone intact and that's what I love about it. So one of the features of this pedal, it's not to freak anybody out, is that with the actual volume control here, it's a crackle OK negative feedback style. Um, pot so as you turn it you'll actually hear an audible crackle come through the speaker or a little you know kind of noise so that's normal don't freak out if you do hear that there's a few pedals i've tested that have had that including zvex and a few other volume sort of preamp boost style pedals so yeah this is really well made and thanks so much to spur guitar tech for sending this out check them out in the description below leave all your comments i'd love to hear what you think of this and let me know what you thought of it in the mix with the slow blues because that's a new thing that i'm doing i hope that actually helps you put into perspective what the pedals do and how they sound you know with music and drums and so forth behind them so leave all your comments give the video the thumbs up if you can and i appreciate all of the feedback and i'll speak to you all on facebook google plus twitter or youtube see y'all